Sprong with Corey Doris of the University of Tulsa. And Corey, this defense today got shocked a little bit early by giving up a little something, but then came back and played awfully well. Talk about just kind of recovering from that first shock and what coaches said when you came off the field. Um, obviously, we came out a little bit flat, but uh, we came to the sidelines, we came together. Um, coaches gave us a little pep talk and told us, you know, get after it or, or else, you know. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding about that. But um, we came together as a unit, you know, we do what we do. And uh, we decided as a unit that we were just going to step out and be the defense we could be, and that's what we did. And everybody talked about coming in off that Notre Dame win, that, you know, whether or not this team would come out fast. And you talked about coming out a little bit slow, but the week of practice leading up, all that kind of stuff, was there a lot of talk about not letting that big win get to be too big? Um, we were <laughs> – Somebody brought up the fact that one of the first things I heard after the Notre Dame Notre Dame game was, uh, "How are you going to stop the letdown? Or, or what are you going to do to not let everyone down and everything about Rice and everything?" It's like we don't think about it like that. Um, I don't care if we're playing Notre Dame. I don't care if we're playing Central Arkansas. I don't care if we're playing USC. Uh, we're going to come out. We're going to prepare the way we prepare, just like any other game, any other day, and we're going to be the best we can. That's how it's, how, how it's going to work out. Now, if we don't come fulfill our fill, do what we're supposed to do, it's our fault. But we're, that's the whole game plan. Every day, every every rep, every set, that's what we're doing. We're trying to be the best we can no matter who we're playing. Corey, you're one of the leaders on the defense. Talk a little bit about the progression of the defense, especially this last three or four weeks and the things that you guys have done now, the flow that you're in, the maturing of what you guys are doing defensively. Talk a little bit about where you guys started and now where you're at. You, you guys are playing the best defense of the year right now. Um, well, right now we're four for five in the last five games. And uh, – Obviously, we should be five for five. Honestly, we're what are, what's our record now? Eight and six and three. Six and three. Well, we should easily be eight and one. I mean, I think, <laughs> but that's just my opinion. Right. Let me throw that out there. Just right. just throw that out there. But um, last five games, we've stepped it up a lot. Uh, we came together as a unit at the beginning of the season. I mean, there was a there were the there were the DBs, there were the linebackers, there's a the D line. Well, now we're we're a solid unit. That's the best way to explain it. Um, we have that relationship together. I think that's something that people talk about, but not everybody has. Everybody wants it, but not everybody can get it. And we have that, and it's being shown with the you last week's game, last today's game. You can show that everybody out there is playing for the guy next to him, and that's the number one thing is that we all care about each other. And whenever people get down, whenever offense starts to struggle, defense steps it up. Whenever defense starts to struggle, offense steps it up. So, I mean, there's there's that relationship there now. And it's being shown. I mean, we're at bowl eligible, so that's a big deal. I mean, you can see it. You you moved inside and played a little more inside today than you normally have. How's that for you? Um, Honestly, I've been playing inside the last month now. So, I mean, it's not really much of a change for me. Hey, Corey, inside the locker room now, it didn't take Coach Graham very long to switch gears instantly and talk about next week's game against Houston. How's that, you know, in your your mindset? Talk a little bit about that. Um, The way I think about it, too, uh, this is – I already – spoke about this but um i prepare for every game the exact same right. but just like coach graham we gotta take this win celebrate and tomorrow it's houston it's just okay. simple as that tomorrow's another day tomorrow's another game and you gotta prepare that way uh we've been playing great but you know what the way we've been playing doesn't matter it's the way we play next week right. and houston, houston's a great game so i mean appreciate you Corey. you did a great job today thanks Thank a lot you, okay From